Hello everybody, uh, this is John Wilbur, President and CEO of the Roadmaster Group. I just wanted to reach out today and speak to all of our employees, all of our owner operators, all of our contractors, and first and foremost, just wish, uh, just hope that you are safe and healthy and your family and friends are the same. Obviously, we're in a national crisis. It's a very serious situation. And again, the most important thing is, is to stay safe and to stay healthy. And we're certainly trying to do everything we can to help you out in, in, in that regard. But um, as you can see, many of us uh, are working in our remotely in our home office, our bedroom office, our garage office, or wherever we can to help support our business. But you know, our technicians are still coming into the shop every day. And most importantly, our drivers all around the country, all around this nation are still coming to work, getting in their trucks and doing their job. And it, it's really incredible to see what's going on here with not only our company, but really our industry in terms of supporting this nation in, in, in the time of need. Um, you know, we're very fortunate here at the Roadmaster Group and at Tri-State and our other divisions that we have a business to come to every day, whether we're coming to our home office or, or getting in the truck or going to a shop. Our business is pretty, as you know, is pretty healthy right now. and we're, we're busy supporting the military. We're also moving medical uh, PP&E and we're just doing anything we can to, to help this uh, country get through what we're doing, what we're going through right now. And I, and, and I know we will get through it. So. Again, first and foremost, uh, and particularly to the drivers out there, our, our company drivers, our owner operators, our local, thank you very, very much uh, for what you're doing. It's really incredible. Uh, and I'm honored and humbled to be part of an organization that supports uh, people like you. It's, it's incredible. Um, you know, every, almost every state now and most counties and most cities are in some kind of lockdown, quarantine, or isolation. But nowhere in this country are trucks shut down nowhere and that that's pretty amazing when you think about it in, in that we those trucks are still moving they're still supplying the goods they're still supporting the military they're still supporting all essential businesses and services but even though the almost the entire country is locked down trucking is essential everywhere and it continues to move and i, I think we just uh we take that for granted i think at times and you really it really shines a, a light on it right now in terms of how important and how essential uh, trucking, particularly our kind of trucking, is to America. Um, you know, the uh, COVID-19 crisis is going to change. It's going to change the country. It's going to change the way we work. Probably going to be a lot of more, a lot more remote working and things like that in the future. But the one thing it's not going to change: trucks are still going to deliver everything. Trucks are still going to move America. And um, that's, you know, a silver lining out of all of this. It's shined a little brighter light on the fact that truckers are first responders. It really bears repeating. Truckers are first responders. And it doesn't matter whether it's a, a, a local disaster, a regional disaster, or a national emergency like we have today. Truckers are first responders. They are moving, they are going into hot spots like New York, New Jersey, Seattle, Louisiana, doesn't matter. They're going anywhere and anywhere they need to to, to serve this country, to serve their business. And uh, it's appreciated very much by myself and everybody in the, in the, uh, uh, in the company. Like I say, I'm, I'm honored and, and humbled to be part of an organization that supports a, a, a group of truckers like we have at, at Roadmaster Group. Um, the uh, and again, I think that anytime we see one of our drivers on the road or in an office or in a shop, we owe them a thank you. Uh, it's exacerbated today. We really owe you a thank you, but we owe you a thank you all the time. Um, one of the things we're going to do in a small way is tomorrow on Monday, we're going to launch a, a basically a COVID relief appreciation pay for all of our drivers, whether you're a company driver or a uh, owner operator. We're gonna have a little extra pay for the month of April starting tomorrow. We may extend it uh, for a month or two if, if this continues, but it's, it's, it, the details will be announced tomorrow. You'll all get that, but it's a, just a, a small way for us to just get a little more money in your hands over these trying times. Even if you're working and you're working a lot, it's still some extra funds for you and your family to help out where needed. So we're certainly happy to do that, but most importantly, it's just a, it's a small way to thank everybody for what they do. Um, and, and again, that's, that's really all I wanted to say was uh, we're thinking about you. We're certainly doing everything we can to support you out in the field. Uh, and again, we're proud to be part of a company 
that has uh, drivers like we have here at Roadmaster Group and at Tri-State and ADCO and Roadmaster Specialized. So again, stay safe, stay, stay healthy, and, and thank you very much. It's appreciated. Take care. I gotta turn the camera off myself.